I was, why me? Why Ken Renner? I was born and raised in California. I know California. I'm 23 years in real estate. That's all I've done in my entire professional career. I bought my first house when I was 19 years old. I moved to Austin in 1993 uh, to become a bigger fish. And I know Austin, okay, after all these years. Once again, 26 million in home sales in 05 and over 30 million. Yeah, that's uh, 167 homes last year. Uh, that's, that's quite a bit of volume. 167 homes that we did last year. Uh, and, and this year we're about 150, but the prices have gone up and we've also sold some large second homes and some large, large homes to some investors and so actually people that are planning, they're buying their retirement home now. So they're out there spending, we'll show you some of those pictures of some of these beautiful homes that they're getting for five, 600,000. They'll eventually move into and use the tax, the tax laws to their benefit. Um, that's a home every other day, all every day of the week. So we're very, very active in this market. We have an excellent, excellent reputation with the builders and also with the other realtors, which is important. We've got a really good, we, we take good care of our clients and, and we, we, we're very low profile and high volume. We're not about the egos, we're not peacocks, we're not out there at all the realtor parties. We're about selling real estate, get, taking care of our investors and taking care of our builders. Our builders, DR, the uh, president of DR Horton called me today, didn't know I was gone. He called me today and asked me what my take was on the market. And I'm not saying that to impress you, but I can never get a hold of him. But he called me today and said, hey, what's your take on the market? How are things going? And it was like, interesting. Uh, that's the number one builder in the nation, the number one builder in Austin. And the president and the vice president are calling me to get my take on the market. Um, I'm a good old boy. And if you know what that means in, in Austin, is that there's a lot of Californians and actually from all over the country coming in and they're, they're throwing their weight around, they're throwing their money around, but you know, their doors are being shut to them. Because why? They're not a good old boy. And a good old boy really means is that it takes years and years of trust and building up that trust of relationship with these, with these, with these builders and with the uh, real estate community that I've became, become a good old boy. All right, I work for you once again. I don't represent anybody but my clients here. So I wanna make sure that you understand that when I'm working, when you're, if you come out to Texas or even if you buy sight unseen, that I'm representing the buyer here. I'm representing you. Okay, my idea is to get you the best deal. I don't represent any builders. I don't represent any sellers unless I'm the, the dual agent and that's, that's okay too because I still want you to get the best deal. And why? Because you're gonna come back. Every home sale that I see that I do for you is two home sales. And why is that? Because I want you to come back in five or seven years when it's time to liquidate the property and I want you to use me as your broker as, as the person that also helps you get through the, the, the exit strategy of the property, okay? So I'm looking at every property I sell, number one is two sales, one going in, one going out. And the second thing is that I, my philosophy is I will not sell a property that I wouldn't buy myself, okay? So that's another thing is that, and I own 18 residential properties right now plus some other properties, but I'm in, constantly in and out in the trenches buying and selling property. I work with investors. You can call up any Keller Williams agent. You can call up uh, any Remax agent and they'll sell you a house, but they don't have a system in place. And that system is a system of not only being able to acquire properties that are, a lot of them aren't even on the market, but also be able to, um, be able to uh, hook you up with the right type of lenders who know the real estate, how it works, and how are used to dealing interstate, because most lenders aren't used to dealing interstate. I have hand-picked property managers that um, I give a ton of business to. Remember, 200 sales, 300 sales in the last two years, that, those, those go to property managers. I manage those managers, so I have some clout with those managers and make sure that they're gonna do a good job. Um, and I also invest in the product that I sell. If you get a chance to come out and take a tour with me, you're gonna see as I travel through the, uh, the Austin area, I'm gonna say, I own that one, I own that one. John owns that one, Chris owns that one, and it's, it's really fun. It's kind of like East California. 